just got a call in from our sister ship that uh, there's been some killer whales encountered with uh, with the gray whale. So possible attack. Right, I'm going by the size of the spout, and I think I saw a tail go up in the water just out of the corner of my eye. By the time the crew arrived 30 minutes later, the killer whales were in the final stages of their attack on the grey whale calf. They'd managed to separate the calf from its mother and were repeatedly pushing it under the water in an effort to drown it. To even witness an attack is surprising, but what happened next is truly remarkable and to the best of our knowledge has never been filmed before. As the orca continued their attack, the crew noticed two humpback whales who seemed to be intervening in an effort to protect the grey whale and her baby. They appeared to be placing their own bodies between the wounded grey whale calf and the killer whales. Sadly, Despite their best efforts, they couldn't save the car. But the humpback whales remained in the area, following the orcas, trumpet blowing, rolling and tail slashing in an effort to prevent the killer whales from feeding. Six hours later, the humpbacks were still there, but the killers shared the spoils with the albatrosses, while the grey whale mother continued her journey north alone.